One Blues fan isn't just mourning the loss of last night's game. He is also saying goodbye to all of his memorabilia that he collected for years. Live on your side, Justina Cornell spoke to Michael Hamilton today, and Justina reports he lost his connect collection in a house fire. That's right, Mike. It happened on Friday in O'Fallon, and today Hamilton is still at a loss that his collection is now gone. He had heard that a fire broke out in his room, and when he got home, he couldn't believe what he saw. I went inside and just my room was completely black. I, everything was melted. Things on the wall were just burnt. After making sure everyone is okay, the next question was, What about Michael's hockey collection? Is that okay? Michael Hamilton has been collecting blues memorabilia for years. Having all that stuff meant a lot because I really love the people and the players. The franchise is great. But in seconds, it's all gone. Bobbleheads are all black from uh, the soot and smoke. Hockey pucks from uh, the 14 fund of the blues and uh, they're all autographed. I had a bunch of bobbleheads from all the different bobblehead nights. Almost 100 hockey pucks signed, ruined. Puck stand made out of hockey sticks. And you can see where the pucks were, where the burns are from the fire. Autographed jerseys covered in ashes. There's these like plastic tiles that like fell from up here and melted onto it. He almost had like his own little museum of stuff. He had printed canvases that were signed, a Brett Hull jersey that was signed. Even though these may be material things, for the Hamiltons, hockey is a way to bring the family together. The Blues mean a lot to our family. It's a good way for us to connect. We all love watching hockey, and that's just how we all bond. We're diehard Blues fans. We bleed blue through and through. Despite this awful thing that happened, the family is hopeful they'll be able to rebuild the collection piece by piece for now. They say, let's go blues. And if you want to help out the family, we posted a link on our website, kstk.com.